Shaitali Bagh, Chief of Bureau with Aviation Defense Universe and I am at Abu Dhabi first day of IDEX NAVDEX 2023 and I am at NAVDEX with our very own Brahmos. I am sitting with uh, Atul Dirane who is the CEO and MD of Brahmos Aerospace and today I am going to talk to him about the Middle East business with Brahmos. Welcome sir to our chat room, thank you so much for your time. Sir, uh, Brahmos has been participating in NAVDEX for a very long time. So this time, what is new Brahmos has got for the Middle East market? Well, uh, Brahmos has been evolving since 1998, since we started. Uh, we evolved from an anti-ship cruise missile to a land attack missile, uh, launchable from a ship from the land. We have gone on to prove it in underwater. We have gone into the uh, uh, air launch versions also. So our, our forces, proud to say that our forces have all three versions, a triad of supersonic cruise missiles. Uh, we are bringing the same showcase here to, into the Middle East to IDEX and NAVIX. Uh, with the idea that you know, we have a little more publicity in this place. We have been coming here, but uh, we have a little smaller weight. This time we have come with a similar size pavilion but with all our versions on board. Uh, hoping to catch the eye of each one of the people who pass by and uh, especially the authorities who make decisions. Sir, uh, one thing, at the present circumstances, Brahmos is in joint venture with Russia. So, at the present circumstances, is that affecting at NAVDEX anyhow? Not at all. Uh, number one, uh, NAVDEX and IDEX has a huge presence of the Russians here. So the Russians are there all over the world. As a, as an arms seller, as a partner, they will always be around. Brahmos is a joint venture. So what? Uh, Brahmos is being sold by Brahmos Aerospace, an Indian company. Whether we have the Russians behind us, which they will always be, uh, it has no has no effect on our participation anywhere and our selling to any country which is mutually acceptable to both India and Russia. Right. Sir, uh, another thing, uh, Middle East is a very different market than the rest of the world. So, is Promos planning something different for Middle East market? Uh, or it's a uh, regular products that you Brahmos has always been having? Yeah, you see, what, what, we, what we have to do right now is to go for the vanilla Brahmos. The normal Brahmos which is fitable on the uh, ships, which goes on our mobile autonomous launcher, as well as on the Su-30s. And luckily the Su-30s are not many of them in the Middle East, so the aviation version is not what they are interested in. Uh, so it's the mobile autonomous launcher as a land-to-land -land or a coastal battery. And on the ships, if uh, they show interest, the uh, idea is showcase and come here with the new experiences we have had over the last two years. Each time we come here, we have had more experiences. We are able to share those experiences with them. What would be more interesting for them on the air version is we are going in for our uh, next generation Brahmos, which is smaller, which we will be doing uh, our tests of the Su-30. But later on, we will be uh, able to fit this particular missile onto Western platforms also. We'll start with Tejas, our light combat aircraft. And once we do that, we are capable of putting onto any Western aircraft also. So the idea is uh, show the interest, show them that this is also what we are doing. And maybe three years down the line, we'll be able to sell something which goes onto their aircraft also. But as you said, they are more interested in the land to land and the coastal. So anything new in that front? Um, Brahmos has been the same since 98 till now. We only improved its capabilities in terms of uh, uh, speeds, in terms of accuracies, in terms of carrying capability. The missile main characteristics are one and the same. Oh, About the new, uh, the, the 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 development that you are talking about, the missiles for the aircrafts. Can you tell us more about it, sir? Yeah, uh, currently we are on the Su-30 under the uh, uh, belly. Uh, it's a 2,550 kilogram missile, which is too heavy to be carried by any other aircraft. In fact, it's the heaviest store that the Su-30 carries, or a anywhere wherever the Su-30s are. Uh, we are going for half the weight. Not exactly half, but near to half. 1,330 kilograms is what we are aiming for, which is capable of being carried on uh, two wings of any aircraft, 1330 is like any other weapon, the 
characteristics of it would be it's smaller, it's lighter, it's meaner. Uh, it has exactly the same specifications of the current drum. We are just miniaturizing, repackaging the whole design into a And the efficiency says stays the same. Absolutely, no difference. So it is being, uh, it is going to be tested with the Indian aircraft first, and then you are going to market it first. Yeah, what we are uh, planning is uh, we have finished our uh, preliminary design. We have gone into the detailed design. Uh, we have started it off. Uh, before we start cutting metal to actually create uh, test articles, we will be looking for infusion of money or a project from uh, uh, either of the governments, that is the government of India or the government of Russia, or maybe wholly from the government of India. We Once we start that, I think by the end of uh, uh, 24, beginning of 25, we'll start the live flight trials of actual design. Till then we'll be using mock dummies under the uh, aircraft to uh, move the whole flight envelope and going for flight trials by mid-25 definitely we should have culminated and by uh, end-25, beginning of uh, 26, get into production. Wonderful, that's, that's, a, that's something new that we got to know today from you and uh, today being the first day of Netflix, we really hope a large footfall here because from past 2021 uh, edition of Napdex after COVID, this is supposed to be one of the biggest one of IDEX Napdex story. Thank you so much for your time, sir, and we really hope and expect that next few days really uh, are very good and fruitful for Promos. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you for having me. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.